Hi, I'm George with Studio Binder, and today we're talking again about production calendars. Now, by now we've gone over how to nest events into groups, which makes your calendar a lot cleaner looking. But what happens when you have multiple projects all on one slate? Well, if you're anything like me, you're probably gonna go ahead and put them all into the same timeline. The only problem with that is a lot of projects have the same kinds of events and similarly named events, so suddenly it's very easy with overlapping projects on the same timeline for things to get confused. I'm gonna show you a really easy way that you can make this never happen in your production calendar on Studio Binder. Let's take a look. So we're gonna go over here in our production calendar, up to the upper left, and we're gonna click on this drop down menu for production calendars. And as you can see here, we have the one we've selected with the check mark next to it. And we'll drop all the way down here and we'll see this button, add calendar, click right here. Now we'll be prompted in this modal to enter the name of the new calendar. We'll call it documentary, we'll click next. We'll choose an unscripted template, create calendar. And there we go, our calendar is created. It's a whole new timeline. It can be a blank canvas or a template and a new calendar can go here. Now, what makes this so cool is that we can go right back up here to the calendar dropdown and see all the other calendars under this project. So Touring Man short film, if I wanna go back, I'm right back here and I can see this calendar again. And of course, if I wanna to go to my new documentary timeline, it's here. And of course, I can start creating events. So it's that easy to create multiple production calendar timelines and swap between them. Next time, we're gonna go over how you can use templates to customize and streamline your workflow. In the meantime, let us know what you think. And if you wanna see more pro tip videos like this one, just follow us and check back soon. Thanks so much.